This Money Saving Monday, we're talking about concerns over a potential recession. Stocks took a tumble today with the Dow seeing its worst day in nearly two years. But as 12 News journalist Tricia Hendricks found out, now is not the time to panic. We saw uh, markets in Japan start to take a tumble, pretty big tumble. Uh, it goes all the way back to 1987 till the last time we saw something like that. So U.S. markets, European markets started to catch wind of that and things kind of started to take a tumble here as well. And financial advisor Shane Stevenson with Winston and Company's Retirement and Financial Services says there's a couple reasons for that. The unemployment figures that came out have a lot to do with it. The Fed is talking about cutting interest rates, which we see uh, likely to happen later this year. And that's probably because of those unemployment rates. Inflation plays a big role as well. Absolutely. And CPI numbers came out recently, not as bad as they've been, uh, which is good. About 3% is the most uh, recent number. So hopefully that continues on that trend. But if we do see those unemployment rates continue to go up, we will likely see the Fed meet even sooner to start cutting interest rates, which will also hopefully start to ease this issue. While situations like this can often cause people to make emotional decisions. When you see your money going down, it's tempting to jump out of the market, sell, go to cash. But what happens is you guarantee the loss at that point. If the idea with investing is to buy low and sell high, if you now sell low, you're basically doing the exact opposite of what you know you should. Shane says this isn't the time to panic. We typically think of a, a downturn or a recession once we get over 10 or even 20 percent uh, or we have two negative consecutive quarters of CPI numbers, which we're not seeing at this point. Here are three stock market strategies he recommends. First, invest consistently. He says don't stop. The markets will come back. Next, continue to add diversity to your portfolio to help protect against these issues. And finally, seek professional help to get guidance in managing your money. That can help you control the emotional part of it. What's the bottom line? Bottom line is don't worry yet. We're far from an actual downturn or a recession. This is just a bit of a small correction, a small blip that's expected in an election year and things will turn around. In Phoenix, Trisha Hendricks, 12 News. Trisha, thanks. Don't go anywhere. We have lots more straight ahead.